Well, my son decided to umpire at the start of last year, and so I thought if I'm going to have to drive him down to training, I might as well participate. And I did it when I was a kid, so I've been involved in footy most of my life. I umpired for four or five years as a kid, and then again in my mid-twenties, I umpired in the amateurs, and uh, so this is my second year with the SMJFL. For those that want to sort of go on with their footy and uh, make it a career, I think the academy is very important, and certainly in trying to get the kids from um, sort of entry point to sort of base level of competence, I think it's very important to be able to do that. Uh, fitness at my age, so um, the objective was to try and keep a few pounds off or kilos off, so, um, but yeah, just sort of being fit enough to be able to run the games out, and most weekends I'm doing a couple of games, so yeah, that adds to the challenge. I was looking for a second job actually, and I thought that umpiring was a good way to kind of get back into the community and earn a little bit of money while doing some exercise. I think the academy has really supported me by, you know, these training sessions where you learn so much about the game, but also, you know, working with other umpires and players to like, give umpiring it the best quality. I think it's kind of difficult to make a call and really stand by it, especially when there is pressure from players or spectators, so you've really got to stay with your gut instinct. I really um, like working with other people who, you know, you see them at training and you make some really like interesting friendships. I think it's really important to have a you know, good quality um, umpiring academy with sponsors so that umpires can have the best coaches and equipment and training to have the best games.